Greetings everyone and a warm welcome. In this video presentation, I will cover multiple choice questions MCQs from the General Science Unit focusing on nutrition and its types, respiration, transportation of water, food and minerals in plants. I encourage you to explore additional sources such as Google searches or other YouTube channels for further conceptual clarity. For MCQs on other topics, don't forget to subscribe to my YouTube channel. Let us try to solve some important MCQs one by one from the topics. Question 1. Which one of the following is not a macronutrient? A. Potassium B. Copper C. Sulfur D. Nitrogen The correct answer to question 1 is option B. Copper Explanation Copper is a micronutrient required in small quantities by plants for various metabolic processes. Macronutrients are nutrients required in larger amounts by plants for growth and development. Examples of macronutrients include nitrogen, phosphorus, potassium, sulfur, calcium, and magnesium. Question 2. What is the primary function of carbohydrates in plants? A. Energy storage B. Structural support C. Enzyme activity D. Hormone production the correct answer to question 2 is option A. Energy storage Explanation Carbohydrates serve as the primary energy source for plants, stored in the form of sugars and starches. Question 3. Which process involves the breakdown of glucose to release energy in plant cells? A. Photosynthesis B. Transpiration C. Respiration D. Translocation the correct answer to question 3 is option C. Respiration Explanation Respiration is a metabolic process by which glucose is oxidized to release energy for cellular activities. Question 4. Plants absorb nutrients through their dot? A. Roots B. Stem C. Leaves D. Flowers The correct answer to question 4 is option A. Roots Explanation Plants absorb nutrients primarily through their roots. The root system of a plant is specialized for nutrient uptake from the soil. Question 5 What is the main function of stomata in plant leaves? A. Photosynthesis B. Transpiration C. Respiration D. Nutrient absorption The correct answer to question 5 is option B. Transpiration Explanation Stomata are small openings on the leaf surface that regulate gas exchange, including the release of water vapor during transpiration. Question 6 Which vascular tissue in plants is responsible for the transport of water and minerals from roots to shoots? A. Phloem B. Xylem C. Cambium D. Cortex The correct answer to question 6 is option B. Xylem Explanation Xylem is a vascular tissue that transports water and minerals from the roots to the aerial parts of the plant. Question 7 What is the primary source of energy for the process of photosynthesis in plants? A. Oxygen B. Carbon dioxide C. Sunlight D. Water The correct answer to question 7 is option C. Sunlight Explanation Sunlight provides the energy needed to drive the process of photosynthesis in plants. Question 8. Which pigment is responsible for capturing light energy during photosynthesis? A. Chlorophyll B. Carotenoids C. Xanthophylls D. Anthocyanins The correct answer to question 8 is option A. Chlorophyll Explanation Chlorophyll is the primary pigment in plants that absorbs light energy for photosynthesis. Question 9. In which cellular organelle does photosynthesis primarily occur? A. Nucleus B. Golgi apparatus C. Chloroplast D. Mitochondrion The correct answer to question 9 is option C. Chloroplast. 
Explanation Photosynthesis primarily occurs in chloroplasts, where chlorophyll captures light energy to synthesize carbohydrates. Question 10. What is the role of translocation in plants? A. Transport of water and minerals. B. Movement of sugars from source to sink. C. Absorption of nutrients from the soil. D. Exchange of gases during respiration. The correct answer to question 10 is option. B. Movement of sugars from source to sink. Explanation. Translocation is the process of transporting sugars produced during photosynthesis from the source, leaves, to the sink, growing or storage tissues, in plants. Question 11. Which plant tissue is responsible for providing mechanical support and protection? A. Epidermis B. Cortex C. Xylem D. Sclerenchyma The correct answer to question 11 is option D. Sclerenchyma Explanation Sclerenchyma tissue provides mechanical support and protection to plant organs due to its thick, lignified cell walls. Question 12. What is the primary function of phloem in plants? A. Transport of water and minerals. B. Photosynthesis. C. Transpiration. D. Transport of organic nutrients. The correct answer to question 12 is option. D. Transport of organic nutrients. Explanation. Phloem is the vascular tissue responsible for transporting organic nutrients, such as sugars and amino acids, from sources to sinks in plants. Question 13. Which of the following is not a micronutrient essential for plant growth? A. Iron B. Magnesium C. Zinc D. Nitrogen The correct answer to question 13 is option D. Nitrogen Explanation. Nitrogen is a macronutrient required in relatively large quantities by plants, while iron, magnesium, and zinc are micronutrients required in smaller amounts. Question 14. What is the primary function of potassium in plants? A. Structural support. B. Energy storage. C. Enzyme activation. D. Photosynthesis. The correct answer to question 14 is option C. Enzyme activation. Explanation Potassium plays a crucial role in enzyme activation, osmoregulation, and the regulation of stomatal opening in plants. Question 15 What is the process by which water is lost from the aerial parts of plants to the atmosphere? A. Transpiration. B. Photosynthesis. C. Translocation. D. Respiration. The correct answer to question 15 is option A. Transpiration. Explanation. Transpiration is the process by which water evaporates from the stomata of leaves and is released into the atmosphere. Question 16. Which plant hormone is responsible for promoting cell elongation and growth? A. Auxin. B. Gibberellin. C. Cytokinin. D. Abscisic acid. The correct answer to question 16 is option A. Auxin. Explanation Auxin is a plant hormone that promotes cell elongation, root formation, and tropic responses in plants. Question 17 Which process involves the movement of water and dissolved nutrients from the roots to the aerial parts of plants? A. Transpiration. B. Translocation. C. Photosynthesis D. Respiration The correct answer to question 17 is option B. Translocation Explanation Translocation is the process of transporting water and nutrients from the roots to the aerial parts of plants through the xylem and phloem. Question 18 What is the primary function of magnesium in plants? A. Protein synthesis B. Chlorophyll synthesis C. Water uptake. D. Stomatal regulation. The correct answer to question 18 is option B. Chlorophyll synthesis. Explanation. Magnesium is a crucial component of the chlorophyll molecule, essential for photosynthesis and the synthesis of carbohydrates in plants. Thank you everyone.
Don't forget to subscribe to my YouTube channel Education and Teacher Education at Shoki Bilal.